mail time. Milton, sit, Bobby. Good boy, good boy, Milton. Good boy, good boy, Milton. Oh, girl, she is running late today, but that's okay because no matter how far behind schedule we are, we always got time to shake it don't we? Now guys, we've reached the point of my Zip Fizz Roulette where it is no longer roulette and all I have is a box of fruit punch. So fruit punch it is, but that's okay because I love fruit punch. So I'm going to go to the gym and I'm definitely not going to have time to go to the store before I get my hair did. So I'm going to go to the gym. I'm going to go to the shop. I'm going to go to the store and then we're going to meal prep. I got my fruit punch that is giving me everything. Oh my God. I have my bottle opener. Who would have thought? Oh, it is a beautifully sunny day outside today. Jeez Louise. All right, guys, you know what to do on this sunny day. It's time to shake it. Gotta be a quick shake though, cause she's running late, okay? In three, two, one. All right, to catching up. Oh yeah. Mm. Okay guys, I am gone from the gym. I'm actually sitting outside the shop. Uh, I have my hair appointment and then I'm gonna go to Meyer. I actually went back to Aldi yesterday and got some stuff. I will put my little mini tiniest of hauls here so that you can see what I got. Uh, I am excited to integrate that stuff into meal prep, meaning that I don't really have to buy a lot from Meyer, which is good. Um, but this week, meal prep is also, I got food going bad and I need to use it. And this week that is hot dogs. So I'm going to grill me up some hot dogs. I'll probably have tuna as well. Uh, and then my first meal, bacon eggs and sausage like what what's new what else I've been doing really well with total carbs these past couple weeks but honestly what I have not been doing well with is intermittent fasting uh, I find myself just hungrier a lot earlier and then snackier like late in the day so I may or may not experiment with food timing or with having smaller, more frequent meals. I know that kind of goes against everything that we've been told in keto. It's like, you only need to eat these big, huge meals and you're totally satisfied. Well, it's like, yeah, but sometimes my mind is hungry. You know, like sometimes I just want something to nibble on, you know, even if that is just like a cheese stick or something like that. So if I make my actual meals smaller, leave some times for snacks throughout the day, uh, maybe that will help with my satisfied feeling. Like, I do feel like I'm eating a good amount of food and I am satisfied. I just found myself breaking it up into smaller portions so that I could have it more frequently. In terms of fat bombs and or sweet treats, I, I'm not sure if I have another keto break. I might try to experiment with another fat bomb recipe today since meal prep's not really that involved. It's been a great day so far and now I'm just excited to sit down and relax if only for a couple of hours before I hop back into meal prep.
in mind I designed this rhyme to remind myself how I tried so, so hard how fancy my hair looks like it's getting long enough to where like I can flip it all over to one side and it stays and then we got this little curl situation going on here like oh my gosh I love it okay so I am done with meal prep for right now I am letting everything cool off and I'm excited to show you all uh, those chocolate peanut butter fat bombs are in the freezer I literally have no idea how they're gonna taste. Uh, I was kind of winging it, so I'm really looking forward to my What I Eat Wednesday video so that I can let you know if I liked them. And if I do, I will include the recipe in that video. There's no point in doing it here because if it's trash, I don't want you to, I don't want you to try it. All right, it is still fairly early in the day, so I am going to do a ton of work. And since I don't have any plans to leave the house, you know what that means, ice cream. So I am definitely having ice cream today. And that makes me so happy because I haven't had it in a while. Also, today I checked my P.O. box and my good friend Deanna, AKA Heartstrings Keto, sent me a package and I'm really excited. So now I'm gonna open it up and see what it is. If you like ever get the inkling to send me anything in the mail, first of all, thank you so much. That means so much. Secondly, I, I always leave my address in the description and I'll go ahead and put it right here in the video. God. First of all, there's a card and I'm so excited. I'm gonna read this BRB. Oh my gosh. Oh my God, if this is what I think it is. Oh my gosh. So the note says, hi Autumn, watching your YouTube videos where you use a spatula to cook your ground beef always makes me wish you had a twisty choppy thingy. Like, oh my gosh. If you guys watch Deanna's stories on Instagram, which you should, Heartstring Keto, she's dropping knowledge, but she always rants and raves about her twisty, choppy, ground beef breaker upper, and every time I look at it, I'm like, you know what, I should really get one of those, and I just never do. Second of all, look at all this fun funfetti stuff that, oh my gosh, this packaging for the win. Oh my gosh, it's a twisty, choppy thingy, oh. Like you guys, I am so, I'm just so excited. And you know the thing is, it's like Autumn, it's a twisty choppy thing that you could have get from Walmart yourself. But like, it's like one of those things where you know you should get it, but you just never do. So the fact that you took the time to send me a twisty choppy thing, like it just means so much to me. And she included a coupon for some Too Good yogurt. Like, you really don't know how much this means to me. <laughs> Thank you so much, Deanna. Like, this, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Thank you so much. Okay guys, I'm wrapping up for the day, so let me show you what I have for meal prep. For breakfast, we have eggs, bacon, and I actually went to Walmart today, and look what I found, spicy sausage. So that makes me very excited to try. And then here are those fat bombs. Look at the ratio of peanut butter to chocolate. Like, I am okay with that. Like, that could possibly be delicious. I can't wait to tell you what I think of these. For my second meal, I'm having hot dogs and then I'm having tuna. So that's gonna be tuna, mayo, mustard, and relish. Just really simple. And then if I have room in my macros, I haven't quite calculated all of this yet, but if I have room, I'm gonna have a cheese stick and some of this bite-sized spicy dry salami. You guys know how I like it. Um, and then for my drinks, I have Powerade, ice drink, and then I got Jello. Overall, really simple this week. I've been letting my ice cream sit out for an hour and I'm very excited because it's time to eat. I am going to taste it for you guys. I already know that I love it. I just kind of want to show it off. 
to experience full flavor, let soften. No truer words have ever been spoken, you guys. Okay, this is what it looks like. Still kind of blocky, but like once you get a once you get a spoon into it, it does soften up. I'm getting my AD keto on right now with these, uh, or should I say high fat, high fun, huh? On with this ice cream review, but you know, it's okay. Mmm. 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 Just rich. Just rich and chocolatey and peanut buttery and smooth and creamy. Like, it's not fair. Wow, Lord. <laughs> I mean, okay, so I'm done. I'm gonna go murder this and then I will see you guys later. Oh, also, something else I wanted to mention to you guys. I get a lot of questions about where I buy my Zip Fizz. You can get it all over the interwebs, but I personally buy mine from Amazon. So I've actually created an Amazon store for all the keto things that I buy online. Um, that is gonna be linked in the description of this and every video from now on. So uh, don't be surprised if you ask me where I buy something and I just shoot you with that link because Amazon is life. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel, Watch Autumn Keto. I make weekly meal preps, weekly what I eat Wednesdays, monthly weigh-ins, monthly keto crate unboxings, and the occasional product review and recipe. You can also find me on Instagram and Facebook at Watch Autumn Keto. Thanks and I'll see you next week. Don't stop